first sea trials of the nuclear submarine Skipjack, an even more revolutionary craft than was the Nautilus, thanks to its fish-type hull, which gives the Skipjack sensational undersea speed and maneuverability. Defense Department films show the debut of the true submarine of the future. Ready? Normally this time would be devoted to your second commercial. However, I'd like to use it now to tell you just a bit about Fleet Admiral Chester Nimitz. How are you, sir? <clears throat> well, I'm delighted to be aboard, to participate in this program. I heard you say that the submarine was one of man's greatest inventions. It might be that, and its most evil one, too. One fire, sir. <clears throat> Thank you, Doc. Three fires. I do, Very happy to see you again, sir. It gives our audience a chance to see just what submarine sailors look like. Now, all of these lads One fire, sir. have gone through a very extensive training. The last two lads over there have just come out, and they're all full of vim and vigor and ready to go to sea. All fine. The two chiefs have been in submarines for a lot of years. Uh -huh. As you know, they're, <coughs> they're selected as being perfect physical specimens. One fire, sir. They have to have good eyes. They have to be men that you can't stampede under any circumstance. That depth's 12 feet. All ahead, one third. All ahead, one third. How much time I got? None, sir. Down periscope. Set. Fire. Fire one. One fire, sir. Fire. Three fires. Boy, that was certainly nerve-wracking. Did that sub get away, Admiral? That one did. I'll be back in just a moment with the Animal of the Week. Our special animal of the week is a toucan, a very strange bird that comes from South America and Central America and Mexico. This one is named Raymond as the special pet of Mr. Blaylock, who's brought him to the program. Uh, what about that big bill there, uh, uh, Andy? Three fired. That tongue must be about, uh, oh, must be about four or six inches long, isn't it? Something it like is. That? It's shaped sort of like a palm leaf. Uh -huh. Thank, Thank you. you. Thanks very much. Thanks very much. I have something very special to show you. This is something that many zoologists have not seen. It is all that is left of the left hind leg of the Fleet Admiral Chester Nimitz. How are you, sir? <clears throat> well, I'm delighted to be aboard. One fire, sir. Will you take a dive? Will you take a dive? So will as I. You take a dive? Will you take a dive? So will as I. Taking a dive, were you taking a dive? Well, so was I. Were you taking a dive, were you taking a dive? Well, so was I. <laughs>